Man, this big scale sad reporting live. You feel me? Tune in to Nolazine. Let's get it. Come on. This episode is brought to you by the Loyalty Club, one of the hottest brands out where they keep their items limited and only for the loyal few. Check us out online at theloyaltyclub.us or if you're in the New Orleans area, you can check us out at our flagship store, 841 Fulton Street. You already know what time it is. Only for the loyal few club time. All right, so I'm um, telling everyone, all right, where you from? I'm from New Orleans, bro. Nigga that grew up in the 17th. Grandma still stay on Belfast from Holly Grove. Graduated from Destrehan. Real tough. So growing up in Holly Grove, like how it was for you? It's the thing, like, like I see, my mama, my mama never, um, we never had our official spot in the city, but we always been in and out, so I always just go with my grandma, talk to her, go over there, chill, but I never went to no city school or nothing like that, like, we never stayed in district, we never stayed in district for that shit. Well, like, my 11th grade year, I could've fucked around and went to Lake Area, I ain't do that shit, though. Just did some more shit, but I was really trying to still play basketball and shit. So, gotcha. So, yeah. how old were you and when you um decided that you know you wanted to get into music? Shit, crazy, bro. I just turned twenty three. What on um, July fifth? We had with it today, August sixth. I turned twenty three. July fifth, big brother. So, I really I ain't never just say I'm about to just start fucking with music. I want to be a rapper, bro. But like, nigga be hearing a lot of shit on that radio. I'm hearing a lot of shit on that radio. Like, you knew. I'm one of them niggas on and off the plane, here and there, everywhere. Like, I'm just like, fuck it. Let's put some shit on wax. Let's let's, let's do it. But this whole mixtape, the out of here shit that we about to roll out on, this shit really been in the making. Like, I been had that done about two years ago. I been sitting on it. Picture that. Got a whole nother tape ready for y'all ass. You probably run that, the blur tape. Blur, this shit a blur. But niggas just like, fuck it, we just gonna... Once we relocated from um from out here, Hurricane Ida had hit, bing, we were staying in the same rules. That was 2022. We moved to Monroe, you feel me? We, we, we did 18 hours fresh from Chicago, bro. We been on the road. But I'm saying this to say like, nigga went to Monroe, never thought about rapping at all. Like, had partners rapping and shit, big cousin rapping and shit. Been roaming around here, niggas rapping, but I'm like, fuck it, let me just do something. Like, let me just do something. I did it though, for sure. And I'm gonna hear y'all feedback about the shit, for real. Like, Gotcha, well, I'm going to give you one better. Talk but anybody me. who never heard you, you know, spit, rap, or nothing. Right, right. I'm going to spit something right now for him. <laughs> Nigga said you want me to spit something right now for him. Shit crazy, man. They can't have this shit right now, man. This shit pay-per-view. See what I'm saying? This shit pay-per-view, brother. Man, I'm getting some game, man. You know, well, interviews well, and stuff. How you, how you feel though? You, how you feel though? You gotta spit you, something. You, you, when you go to Funk Flex and all that, you gotta, you right, know. Right, right, right. You know, this is how you gain fans. That was a bit. No one's even to put a nigga on the spot. <laughs> well, I'm but saying, you ain't got to rap nothing nah, freestyle. Sure, you can sure. rap what you got on your tape. Nah, for shit, sure, sure. For shit, sure, sure. For shit, sure, sure. We'll get back to it. We'll get back to it if I feel like that. We'll, well, I'm letting yeah. you know everything raw. You know they're going to be on. <laughs> <laughs> everything raw, man. For sure. Real too. All right. Real too. So how did you come up when nigga All right, with your rap name? When nigga said, <laughs> I come up with the rap name, Big Scale. Brother, like. Been sad like since I don't know what grade, like social media type shit. Been savage G G Sav, whatever you want to call it. I done did pants for the whole. That, that's what we gonna go at before that dude. Like real hustler, bro. I done did every. I done made every nigga in the city pants skinny. Like y'all niggas at school with them diggers and shit. Just go look at the Twitter, bro. I didn't. That's that's who started that. You know what I'm saying? I started that. Like so, we talking about what you asked me, big bro. Yeah, but how you came with your rap name? With the rap name. And also, you know, you talking about the city, but you right. Yeah, but no, Lazine been in 50 states. You, uh, oh, no, we were hey, I'm trying to gain you something, you know, yeah, I'm trying yeah, to gain some fans yeah, around we, the world. We, yeah, we were a wide too. We were a wide too, but I just want to stamp the bitty, bro, because, you know, you know, nigga got to stamp the bitty. It's bigger than the city, though. It's bigger than the city, and I done been a couple places that's pretty, for sure, for sure. We don't have a million, for sure. Hey, but we barely have a million people sure. live in Louisiana, so Amen. I always tell Louisiana Amen. artists, you need to promote Amen. to the world. Amen. Big scale sad, though, man. I feel like if you go listen to the music and tune in, you gonna overstand what we what we on right now and what we represent. Like shit all off the scale. Got shit sure. So, you know shit sure. Do you have any are like features on you do you have any features on your brand new project? Nah, I ain't got no features. I ain't got no features. It, it, just ain't, you? it, it ain't really yeah, it's just me. Just me. Like I see this shit been in the cut 
for like two years, never been no rapper like that, so, and I ain't no nigga that's just trying to jump on a nigga wave, I don't even know a lot of these niggas, like, I don't know a lot of these niggas, but I'm willing to work with everybody that won't fuck with me, like, I'm willing to work with anybody that won't fuck with me, but I just felt like it was important to go ahead on and fulfill this shit, go ahead on and drop my own shit, let niggas know what's going on, you know, I, I, I had put some shit out before this, I know y'all probably been seeing this shit, doing a lot of promo with the unreleased, I'm released just trying to get feedback, you know, just trying to get my credit credibility. Up. So have you been dropping uh, music videos or you just been dropping straight drop audio, straight audio, right. straight audio. First week out, we had, it was at what, 200,000 views. What, official Florida promo, we was at 65,000 views, four days. GDP put me on that bitch two times. We like 12,000 views on his shit combined. Like, oh, but shout out GDP. Know, shout out GDP for sure. Greedy P, that's my boy, family. Family. Gotcha. But you know, I think about it's the game, man. You know, Talk you trying to get, you know, known worldwide, you know. It's it's kinda easy. I told you it was a cell phone. Like you just Correct. you can shoot yeah, but that audio, you can Correct. shoot that with your phone right and just up. put that out and, and, you, and you can use AI right and put out the words as you can let everybody know, you know, what you're saying. Right. Like the game really easy now. Mm -hmm. Like it's no reason that yeah, but like nobody shouldn't have no video. Yeah. Like you can shoot that with your phone. Yeah, it ain't no reason y'all like, shouldn't have content out. You can like. shoot it like you don't gotta drop no it be a long video on YouTube. You could drop like a second second if a clip on Instagram and roll with it. Real talk, big bro. I'm here. I'm here with you. I'm listening to you. That's facts. Niggas just gotta put their play in motion. Gotcha. Hey, so you know. And be like, what separates you on from everybody else out there? Separate me from everybody else out there. Like, I'm gonna kick it to you. Like, my camp be putting it to me. Like, it's just about your authenticity. Like, who you is, your originality, bro. Like. I don't be on that bitch like, oh, these niggas saying the same thing. I just know how I'm coming. I know how I'm coming. I'm coming different. So, you know, niggas going to listen to it. Y'all going to be able to differentiate this nigga. It's not nothing in one bit at all. Like, not at all. And just off the shit, I done did. Like, I feel like every man that did some shit, walked in on shoes, I done did some shit that a lot of motherfuckers didn't do. A lot of motherfuckers didn't do. And I ain't out here just... On some drill shit, some hype shit, talking about, you know, what I done did. I done up on this nigga, robbed this nigga. No, we on some get money shit, play shit. Don't think it's sweet, though. Don't think it's sweet, though, please. I also tell rappers, if you did do it, don't say it on camera. Please don't. Please don't incriminate yeah, yourself. Yeah, I'm a big, hey, but I'm a big, hey, but I'm a big person on what happens please in the don't. street. Please hey, don't. Yeah, what happens in the street, shit, that can stay off the internet. We caught you up from wrist to feet, from ear to teeth. You gotta Since show it. You see what I'm saying? We got the car tabs on. Where the glasses at? I forgot where I put them at. That's on your chest. Them bitches in the algorithm. Oh, they right here. Uh, <laughs> in the bitches, algorithm? Yeah, them bitches in the algorithm. You see what I'm saying? The real ones. You feel me? Alright. Alright. Pay per view. Shit too easy. I said, what made you go? And I'm like, actually, I'm like, get the car here. Made me get the car here, man. I'm like, look. You know, you gotta look the part, big bro. Gotta look the part. Like I said, we just off the road, 18 hours in. Big bro, like, like I said, the shit I had on, I felt like it was a fit. Niggas know you could go look on a, whatever you want to go look at. I'm talking about Million Roses, a band post to me. What they say? What they say to Million Roses? And really, like, niggas go to acting funny. They really, you feel me? Nola Big Dripper. Like, in this off of, nigga don't even know me yet. You feel me? Just off of, just outside looking in. Made me get the Cartier, it's just like, that's what I seen. I think that's what I want. That's what I want. Hey, every, we need that. Hey, you both to buy what you want, though. Amen. Amen. Gotcha. So, Amen. you know, jumping in this game. And that shit was know. a gift to the label, though. A gift from the label, like. Okay. <laughs> shit was a gift from the label, man. And so, jumping in the music game Talk so far, me. tell me what do you enjoy most about it, and like, what do you actually hate about it? Do about it is Cartier is a fail. We don't cherish this shit though. Look, what I what I like about it is like how I'm able to express myself and me being different, bro. Like the traction it picked up to where it's like I appreciate how motherfuckers respect what I got going on, being able to open the door for me just to see it. How it is. It's a little small taste. Like it's 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 some shit like this, bro. Like motherfuckers to see what you could. The same thing you would do with 10 bands, you would do with 10 million. So we trying to see what you what you doing with this little shit right here. How, how you about to execute? Niggas don't know if I'm signed or if I, you feel me? Niggas don't know. 
And that's how I wanted to be. Niggas don't know if I'm from the Biddy. Niggas don't know if I'm from LA. Like, we, we, we real rounded around this bitch, but back to what you talking about, what, what really made me want just like the music is just because I like to express myself, bro. I was making clothes before this. Anything creative, however I could get my point across. And then don't let me, don't let you tell me if I do some shit that's coming out of my heart, and then we can 10 exit, oh, a thousand people about to hear this, a couple people about to hear it. And then it's quality work, come on, let's, let's do it, let's get it. Let's get it. What I don't like, I can't say I don't like nothing yet, because I'm, I'm just walking in the door with this shit, big bro. That's some honest shit. Like, I ain't, I'm, 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 I'm loving everything that come with it. And I'm a nigga that take a grain of salt with everything. So, yeah. So how, uh, so how, so how important it is to you to actually, talk to me. I'm like, actually, actually put money behind yourself and actually, mm -hmm. I'm like, market yourself. Mm -hmm. You got to. You got to. You got to walk it and talk it. Like, got to walk it and talk it. Got to, like, Motherfuckers respect that money, I ain't like that's what they respect the money, bro. Like, I ain't biting no nigga away, but that money is what niggas, yeah. That's the only way motherfuckers gonna take you serious right now. It's 2024. I tell people, man, it but being a rapper is very expensive. Very expensive. But you just gotta find ways to make you some money, baby. You know, you gotta create yeah. some merch, you gotta do yeah. different things. You gotta, yeah. and you gotta like surround yourself around people that can mm -hmm. actually help you grow. Mm -hmm. And that's what I want to do. I don't want no niggas thinking like, oh, this nigga stuck up, ooh, whatever the case may be. You know, outside looking in, you, you see a nigga face, you'll be like, oh, he he probably one of them type of niggas, man. Get around me, talk to me, DM me. You feel me? Yeah, regular nigga. Like, a lot of these niggas, we don't even got nobody that didn't really blew up. Like, I promise you, everybody that didn't blew up, I didn't been around them. For sure, been around them. You know what I'm saying? Whether they know me or not, niggas been seeing my face. Niggas been seeing my face. And we see a million faces, but you know, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm around. It ain't no, it ain't no no shit like, damn, who? nah, niggas, yeah, niggas know, sure. And I ain't glorifying it. It's just you know, official is official, bro. Like I didn't, I'm in my own lane. So if you don't know me, it's good. I don't want you to know me. But if you do know me, last time you seen me, it was probably, probably put a smile on your face. Probably made you think about some shit. Good too. I tell people, you know, even you know, like with that being said, you have to um, like grow your own, have like grow your own fan base, mm -hmm. and your own co following like mm -hmm. kind of like what Currency did. You know, everybody mm -hmm. gonna like your music. Everybody gonna like fuck. Everybody not gonna like my interviews. Look, you just gotta find people for you. That's what I'm telling you. Like shout out to Skeesh. Shout out, to, shout out to Skeesh. You know, that was my people for the longest. That's, that's really family. Like I, I could, I could recall like yesterday, nigga had first took me in the jet lounge. We, we had the um. Uh, you know his little shit he do at the uh, House of Blue or whatever he do the legit long shit like nigga around stars and shit like that like you know just doing pants and shit certain people in my DMs the blue check shit that I have a nigga height shit normal though like but you know God put you in front of shit introduce you to shit cause you just might be in a certain arena where it's like alright this is why I was paying you for this shit real talk bro real talk shit show gotcha. shit show so you just gotta stay prepared. Like keep your face clean, keep your name clean, stay prepared, stay consistent with everything you doing. So, I mean, fuck what everybody else talking about. That's what I'm on. Fuck what everybody else talking about. You don't gotta like me. I promise you. So hey, but who your top five greatest music artists of all time? Top five. Brother, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. Like, as far as music, I'm too like what I'm trying to say like I'm too well rounded with the shit I don't really got a top five like it's like I got a unlimited like I don't just like one rapper like you can't everybody. cause if you yeah if you say if you say you got a top if you got a favorite rapper bit that mean you about to OD off of just everything he got like he not popping that much of shit like nigga it's too many different humans out here no, I don't got no favorite top five top one I, pr I promise you I promise you fuck that shit <laughs> Fuck that shit. Gotcha. I like, I, but this is what I'm gonna say though. Every nigga craft, I might not like 50 songs out of the 55 he got out, but I might like one. Like, I ain't, I like. Yeah, like, that's all that matters. That's huh? all that matters, as long as you got something that, you know. Yeah, for sure. Gotcha. Yeah. So, you know, speaking on, you know, Talk in between me. the fashion and everything like that. Talk to me. 
do you plan on, you know, ever dropping? I'm like, more, I'm like, merch? I'm like, getting into like fashion shows or anything like that? All that shit coming, big bro. All that shit coming, like, me fucking with some, some, some shit behind the scenes, you know, certain the labels, certain the companies talking to me, like, it, it, it's some shit coming. It's some shit coming. I'm just trying to get my feet on the ground for real, stay consistent with this shit. Put some points on the board and really then I'm gonna yeah, we're gonna capitalize on everything else. But when you trying to get your hand into like three, four, five things, a lot of niggas can't chew gum and walk at the same time. Like, but stay on one thing, focus on it, then go to the next thing. Then go to the next thing. But yeah, with the clothes, that shit like that shit like, yeah. You're right. Clothes is I love them clothes, bro, but it's a time for everything, that's all. I didn't can't that that's what I was telling you before the camera started rolling though, like I I was fucking with the clothes before that. Like that's how I got a little name around this bitch. Fucking with the clothes, throwing parties, Airbnb shit. There's some nice little names in that bitch. Me, me, me and my cousins in them, 16, 17. Crazy shit. Like, yeah, yeah. All right. So, mm -hmm. hey, but do you actually? I mean, miss? I'm like throwing parties. I really do, cause I keep joking about the shit. Like I really do, bro. I really do. Like, just the whole moving the crowd type wave. Like, fool, we was just running that too for the camera roll. I was just telling you we had moved from Hurricane Ida, shit like that. So I've been gone from the bitty from like 2022, no what, 2020, 2020 to now. Like I ain't been back out here, but yeah, like we had our own little lounge and shit. I did. I had the lounge and Hammond and shit. We had some shit going. The whole Hammond, the whole Silu, we had that bitch rocking for sure. For sure, Hurricane Ida can't sweep that bitch. Four months, six months in the opening that bitch, like real talk. Gotcha. Right, so. so I'm like, what do you see a music career going? I'm like, three years from now. Three years from now, you know what's crazy? I had one perform, and this is the thing. That's why you don't judge a nigga. That's why you don't just look at a nigga and be like, oh, you know, put put certain little shit on him. Cause I had went to Atlanta and perform on um, a little showcase and shit, and niggas went as far as to saying, all right, we 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 gonna have a little consultation with you. Woo -woo. Nigga on the phone, I'm like, he like paid twenty five hundred to sign. What? Nigga paid twenty five hundred to sign. Brother, I'm like, what the fuck? So what come with the twenty five hundred to sign to y'all? Like, and then and keep in mind, like on some real, you know, businessman shit. I'm like, you know, like what what this entail? Like how I'm a ten x woo. -woo. Nigga, nah, bro, nah, nah, I ain't going for this shit. I ain't gonna lie, you in Atlanta. I've been full of scammers. They fucking man. Hey, but they'll say your fake pocket is Look, full. nigga won't say your fake bottle, liquor. Nigga, brother, nigga won't say. Nigga said, first of all, brother, I'm knowing what I had out at the time. Ain't even dropped yet. Niggas out there sweating, slaving to really win a chain and a. You feel me? You see what I'm saying? Like, man, look, shit, I release. Homie, like, um, oh. dude got on the phone. He like. But you ever heard that before? Like, like dude got on the phone. He like, man, you probably gonna be the, in the same place. If, in the next five years, you ain't going nowhere in the next five years. I'm like, yeah. That's wild. You know what I'm saying? But I never heard nobody say you got to pay them to sign them. How I'm going to pay you to sign, bro? What the fuck? Come on, bro. Hey, but if I'm at your, like, artist show, obviously, but I want you to give me some money. You feel me? <laughs> I don't you know. know. You feel me? Shit be crazy, though. Like, they, they, they be trying to bait that niggas that don't really be knowing what's going on. Niggas that's just thirsty to... Get a little, you feel me? But actually, but twenty five dollars is wild though. Cause it's, it's really twenty five dollars for real, like. But I ain't paying. The average nigga ain't got no twenty five dollars either. The like, average nigga <laughs> got twenty five dollars for sure. We call that shit twenty five dollars. A thousand is a dollar. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, we ain't doing that. We ain't doing that. My outfit right now, damn near thought wild. You see what I'm saying? Shit different, dog. You keep that bitch rolling over this thing, bro. Cool right he now. definitely walked off from the camp. <laughs> that's what a guy. Shit's so natural, bro. Shit's so natural. Niggas are sitting in front of the camera trying to think every way to go viral right now. Like, yeah. So, like, how you feel <laughs> about that, you know? Because, you know, people been saying some wild shit on camera. Mm -hmm. They be that wild shit in the, uh, in the comments. Like, just a little shit. Niggas just starting out to see, like, it be, it be little wild shit, but you got to be used to this shit. If you ain't accustomed to it, like, you know, shit be crazy. Shit be so crazy, though. Don't think, you feel me? This is some shit I broke. What I just, I just broke a honey, huh? This shit changed, bro. Man. Shit 
Shit, like grown men keep debit cards and shit like that, bro. I ain't on this bitch showing no money and shit. It's just simple. I'm trying to get my my phones on my pocket. Hmm. Gotcha. So, talk to me, bro. All right, what's next for you? Shit, what's next for me? It's just, it's just more motion, like just more me being creative, like just more be being creative, and like I tell a lot of niggas behind the scenes, like. I ain't no nigga, don't book my look, don't book a look, bitch. Don't 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 book me just on Instagram popping shit or you like the fashion and shit, bitch. Listen to me, listen to what I'm telling you. Pay attention to the details I'm telling you. Go listen to my music. Cause it's real life, like nigga. I could be somewhere in jail right now. Like I'm glad I didn't, you feel me? Wiggle through the matrix and did certain little shit. Cause it's only gonna make everybody that come behind me better, like, cause I got certain shit to what they gonna just skip over a lot of shit. If I feel like they worthy of the shit, that's the thing. It's hard to find motherfuckers that's loyal to the camp, loyal to what you done put down, what you done did. You feel me? They don't respect that shit. But what's next is, it's just it's it's better. Like ten times better every time, big bro. If I won't keep fucking with the music, that's what it's gonna be. I hope niggas catch on to it. If they don't, cool. I fuck around and drop a hundred more mixtapes and don't give a fuck about them. Never blow. Oh, y'all gonna catch on to the shit, cause it's some shit for sure. Hey, you gotta feel like, you know, you never blow. I just tell people, you just gotta find your market. Like you say, find the market, find yeah, your you co-following. Like, it ain't even about blowing, cause a lot of motherfuckers don't understand what blowing is. Like, you don't know what really go into the shit. All you need is some real, like, loyal, genuine mm -hmm. supporters. Mm -hmm. Real talk, real talk. And like, once you find that, though, real talk. And, and they gonna bring a friend. Real talk. You just gotta grow. You gotta know that. You gotta know that somebody gonna bring a friend. Somebody gonna bring a friend. For shit sure. Gotcha. So you know, yeah, but you came back I'm like to New Orleans. Uh -huh. I'm like tonight to do an interview. Uh huh. Real talk. And so how important it was for you, you know, ever just to like, you know, ever yeah. come down here and I'm like pop your shit. Real talk. I'm about to come out here and really, you know, drip off for a little minute, just get back to some of the regular city shit like regular city shit, bro. Like I'm about to just come out here, y'all probably catch up catch the team out. This whole week, I'm out here the whole week. Might stay an extra day. Like, we just out here putting flyers up and shit, rolling out for the mixtape. The mixtape drop on the 10th. That bitch really out right now, but nigga had came sat down with Nolazine, my boy. Like, yeah, That's I'm good, coming man. to you to stamp the shit. Like, I had text GDP trying to see if he want to lock one in. You know what I'm saying? He told me what, what the issue is, you know, how he do his shit. So I'm like, ooh, he stamped you. Come on. Oh, shout yeah, out yo. GDP. Shout out GDP, man. Greedy P. That's my boy, Greedy P. Hey, you yeah. call him Greedy P? Yo, Greedy P, for sure. And why you call him Greedy P? Shit. Nigga named Gregory. Fuck. Nigga with a plan with words and shit. Fuck. Greedy P. Nigga then threw back a couple of them bitches feeling how I felt. Fuck it. Greedy P. That bitch might go viral, huh? Yeah, that ain't no G. That's Greedy P. That's that's nigga greedy named P. Gregory. Shit. Gregory. <laughs> shit. That's my boy, though. He just dropped that shit with Birdman. I be like, look how shit's so relative, dude. Niggas, are, you feel me? Niggas don't know who I'm signed with or who, who behind this. Like, yeah, yeah y'all just seen Birdman talking about fake jewelry. He ain't got nothing on that. <laughs> so, you know, hey, before we leave out here, talk to me. Hey, but give him one of my price check, you know? Yeah, but tell me how much you spent on the frames and the watch. Look, I'm going to tell you this, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm such a real nigga, bro. I'm such a real nigga, bro. My big brother, easy. What you what you cashed on these bitches, bro? I just, look, we in a truck. Hey, man, come jump in the camera yeah, and tell me how much you spent on this, man. In the truck. He like, Jay, put the, put the Cartier's on, bitch. Just put them bitches on, bro. Like, shit, a gift from the label. Shit, free. Shit, free. Shit, relative. Once you get to a certain point, shit become relative, like. Niggas, that's that's a lot of a lot of niggas, brother. Like once you get to a certain point, the information you done accumulated, it's like niggas know what you you feel me. Niggas sizing you up already. Like all right, either you either you didn't been where you supposed to been and went, or you didn't overspent. See what I'm saying? A lot of times niggas overspent. A lot of times <laughs> overspent. Late on rent. <laughs> what today is August six. We just paid rent. What? Five days ago, popping shit, shit out here. Shit. Nigga just told us up. Nigga just told no design. Look, look. Some niggas paying tomorrow. What this shit is? Hey, look. For their late fees. Look, right. it's, it's fees right here. It's fees right here. 109. Niggas knowing. Niggas knowing what's going on, brother. Got bills to pay. Shit real. Hey, shit real. And niggas, bills don't stop. They don't stop. I hope you're a grown man, son, son. Hope you know what come with this shit. <laughs>
Hope you do. Well, for the people, hey, but who don't know if hey, actually what kind of shirt you got on because you do. If you kept jumping up and showing that motherfucker, mm-hmm. so you might want well to tell them, mm-hmm. hey, but what kind of shirt you got on? Brother, I don't even know. This is some of the fly shit I picked up on my way coming from Chicago. I'm like, fuck, we need some shit to put on. I don't know what this is. I wish I did know so they could damn this send a nigga a little, you know. Have a little care package, huh? A little care package. <laughs> we ain't talking on this. We ain't no, we ain't loyalty club. I, I fuck with this shit, brother. I fuck with this shit. We out here in the loyalty club. We we showing some love, politics in the right way, bro. The right way. The right way. Like I said, though, y'all gonna see us. If y'all in the bitty from whenever we drop this bitch, y'all gonna see us. You feel me? Just, yeah, we out here putting the flyers up and shit like that. We, might be giving y'all a fly. Y'all might catch us tomorrow giving all the fly and shit like that. Like I said, the glitch tape out of here drop August 10th. It's out right now, but we came to New Lazine to really put this shit on the map. So that's where we at with it. It's gonna be a lot more going. So I got this question for you. You don't gotta ask me, you don't wanna get in trouble. Mm-hmm. But um, mm-hmm. if you could date anybody in the music industry, mm-hmm. are they, are the, we gonna talk about this. Other, other, I'm gonna get to the world. I mean, who would it be and also tell us why? Touch, it been the music industry? Music industry. If we just talk oh, about, you talk about the whole entertainment we just industry. Talk about the whole entertainment industry as a And thing, who like, never been touched? I don't think nobody even got huh, in not huh, on the camera without being touched. Huh, huh, everybody has been touched. <laughs> everybody been tampered with, huh? There's some bad ones though, I ain't gonna lie. Like once once them people really put me in the door and I'm and I'm wrong. Who you got your eye over though? And I'm wrong with it wrong. <laughs> he knows something. You got your eye on somebody. Hey, hey. No, Lazine, no something. Yeah, but she might be in the waters right now. Shit. Shit, crazy. Man, look, I ain't got no eye. Y'all see, I don't you. I damn near don't want to follow myself. I don't follow nobody. I just be. You feel <laughs> hold eyes for everybody, man. Hello, hold eyes for everybody. How you feeling? That's how I'm feeling, brother. I'm so stuck in my ways. <laughs> so, you know. And like, once you sign, so it was your first, I'm a million dollar check. Mm-hmm. And what is the first thing I'm like that you gonna do? Mm-hmm. I want that. I want that M. I want that M. And that's the thing. Like that M don't even excited, nigga, brother. But I'm gonna be so grateful for that bitch. You feel me? Knowing I didn't work for that bitch, like I'm gonna be grateful. But I tell people I don't want the M. And I need residual income if I get the M. Uh-huh. Cause that M gonna go fast as a motherfucker if you ain't got no residual income coming behind. So, nigga said, M. So, just spend one dollar, so, you ain't M no more. Soon as in, see, that's what we You nine hundred nine. Uh-huh. <laughs> Real talk, shit. Nigga just gonna try to run that bitch up some more, baby, bro. Like, the young nigga in me, I'm 23, like I said before. Like, young nigga in me, though, I'm gonna definitely, yeah, I'm gonna definitely, I'm gonna definitely reward myself. I, I need that vet for shit, so nigga need that vet. Like, that's the thing, too, though. A lot of shit just be so regular to a nigga, bro. I don't know no nigga, like, brother, I. But the niggas didn't see me pull up, whatever, whoever. I don't care. Like I don't care. But you feel me? Ben had drop tops, Mustangs, Benzes, all that shit. I'm 23. Been doing this shit. Just decided I won't rap for real. Cause y'all niggas not giving it right. Y'all niggas not giving it right. You hear me? Gotcha. Y'all lame. Uh uh-uh. uh. Talk hey, to me. Hey, but last but not least, tell the world. I'm like, what can they find you on social media and everywhere else? It's simple. Y'all can find me at B1G, B1G, S C A L E. Crazy how that shit rhyme. B1G, S C A L E, S A V. Yeah, all platforms. Shit going on.